Hey welcome friend what's up in today's video we're gonna talk about how to install Windows 11 on virtual box machine so stay tuned so if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe like comment and of course share so let's get started to do so you need to run your virtual box which are already installed in my case and uh, create a new one add a new machine which is going to be the window 11 make sure that you select the right stuff which is going to be the window 10 so there's no window 11 yet on virtual machine so you need to select that click on next and uh, set up what's the size of the memory we're gonna use normally you require about uh, according to the requirements 4 gig but you can try anything you try but no less than 4 gig to see how it's gonna react so you're gonna change the hard drive as well which is from 50 to 80 gig so and uh, go to the next and follow what I'll put in my screen next again and uh, next again the R drives the size of the R drive and everything is ready so as you can see on the screen for those who have never used the virtual box before just have a time to play around checking all this setting and uh, find exactly uh, what to do and uh, add more information as much you can for example the username the password if you want to or any spec or information you want for the future use so yeah just go around check the box and you got a result and uh, if you're really happy about it what you're gonna do now is to see how you're gonna launch your machine and yes so keep on checking around for your spec and uh, make sure there's not any error so far so good once you're happy with your setting so what you do next is to get your ISO file for window 11 is depending where uh, the location you just put it so you're gonna upload it and uh, take it from there and just click ok then your machine is ready to launch so what you need to do now is just launch the machine and uh, see the reaction once it's done you can see the reaction and uh, the window 11 already start to pop up so to change the language and click start you're gonna see all installation begin to to fire up so you're gonna skip that part just click it and select uh, pro next and uh, tick that box for the agreement and then next again and select customer and select the hard drive we're gonna use the next and there we go so the installation begin now and uh, it won't take a little bit of time so be patient now the machine gonna reboot and uh, the installation is gonna carry on for a little bit longer than that but again it's depending on how fast your machine is and uh, normally taking some time to install properly so let's go and see yeah there we go now we go uh, you're gonna select your language and then next and select your keyboard next and uh, just skip this part
how would you like to use this so select this one personal use then click next on it and here you can use your microsoft account but i'll just select i don't have accounts to just make it easy so you got a choice to use your own hotmail account yeah on this one you just gonna put offline and here you can put whatever username or password you're gonna use but don't worry much about it this is mostly about the uh, uh, microsoft account you go so I'll click next on it and here is gonna have like a quick question about uh, remembering questions like uh, what was your daily pay for what was your first pet you know it's just like uh, to make sure that you go all the information right so you click no on that click next scroll down go no again so we don't need all this no we don't need it again so no again if we go to the next one We are almost there, so a few more minutes. Bingo! We got our window 11 right here and right now. Now you can just rave around, check out all this uh, gadget, all this wonderful feature for window 11. I can show you. I try myself. Really, really, really excited. It's wonderful. So just have the time to play around, go to the Microsoft Edge and uh, see what's new about it and have a fun. That be say I'll finish my video right now. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Tudor. If you do have any question, feel free to post it in the comment section below. So now you can test out your Windows 11 and have fun. Thank you for watching. Again, see you to the next video to come. Wow.